Hi Aquarius, how's it going today? Let's see what we have. Today's October 25th, Halloween's just around the corner, and uh, I'm really excited for Halloween. I love Halloween. Um, I have zero plans this year for Halloween. I'm going to a party on Saturday, but uh, Halloween itself is on Monday this year. Um, I know in Zumba class we talked about dressing up for Zumba, so I know I'll at least be going to my Zumba class on Halloween. So, what do we have here? Some banging, that's for sure. I hear someone hammering. And, ooh, five of cups. Oh dear, Aquarius. I'm sorry. I was doing so well till I hit Aquarius. <laughs> Let me pull another one. I'm pulling another one. We get a bonus pull because it's Halloween. I uh, hope it's not shitty. Okay, Page of Wands is a little better. And Queen of Pentacles. Okay, so now that I'm throwing my cards on the floor. <laughs> oh boy. Let's see. What do we have? We have that Five of Cups is a sad card. I call it the Goth card, really. You know why? Because it's a little dude looking at the, all the cups of wine that he spilled and. He's all upset, thinking about, oh, you know, I spilt all this wine. I, you know, will never get this wine back. I'm lost. The river's turbulent. I can't get home. The bridge washed away, blah, blah, blah. But in fact, five of cups means dude still has a couple of glasses of wine. He just didn't see them because his back was to them. And the bridge to go home is like right behind him too. He just has to turn around see all the good shit. So this card's about... Or things have, you know, it's glass half full or half empty. And Aquarians, we, we're generally optimistic, though I know I can have great bouts of depression, and I know some other Aquarians who do too. Uh, so this uh, card's telling us, like, dude, like, get your shit together. Look at the good stuff that's happening. You got so much good stuff happening. Stop dwelling on the negative stuff. We all have negative stuff too, but you know what? You got some good stuff going on. So, so stay on top of your good stuff. Enjoy your good stuff. And then, you know, like I was kind of saying, I pulled a couple of extra cards just to make soften the blow as it were. So we got our page of wands. So we're going to get some news. And also, uh, some of us might be dealing with a younger person who's a fire sign. I know I'm I have a fire sign son and an earth sign son, and so maybe something's going to happen I need to deal with with my children, but also I'm really hoping it's a younger man coming into my life, and maybe for you too, maybe a younger man or woman, for you single Aquarians, maybe you're, you'll get a date or something. <laughs> Wouldn't that be fun? A date? What's that? What's a date? I don't know. But yeah, so you may have someone uh, come into your life that you've never met before and might offer you some new fantastic opportunities because they have a lot of fire sign energy and fire sign energy is fantastic it's ambition enthusiasm sexual energy aggression you know getting stuff done and really tenacious type people and uh yeah i'd like to meet one of those anyone uh, want to come on by and meet me yeah i want to meet that uh page of wand and uh then another card i randomly pulled out was a queen of pentacles so maybe we'll get some good business stuff done if we stop being negative and start looking positive we just might hit that queen of pentacles which is a great fantastic business card it's a great card for building our businesses for running our businesses for making money for paying people and for creative growth it's also a uh, queen of pentacles is a card about being a good mom helping people that way with motherly energy and advice and stuff like that whether you're a man or a woman it doesn't matter it's just all that great earth sign uh, stability and uh, building business and firm foundation and creative growth that's happening so really our card is good Five of Cups is good. We are looking at the positive side of the Five of Cups, and the Five of Cups is rocking it. We are rocking it. Uh, some other people had, other signs had fives in, in this little cluster of readings I'm doing today. And five, as I mentioned to others, it's a number of transition, things moving, things changing. It's a very temporary transitory state. So um, Cups are emotion and passion. So we may be feeling emotional but it's just for a little while then we're back to our old cold selves where we don't give a damn about it no, I'm just kidding <laughs> But really, um, if you are depressed, uh, get help. Uh, you know, there are hotlines. 
uh, to call, you know, it's that very rough time of year, even though it's sunny right this minute, it was very dark all day, it's been dark for days. That can be really hard for a lot of people, not just Aquarians, but all people who suffer from depression and seasonal affective disorder. There are helplines, there's help. Please don't suffer alone and uh, get some help if you need that, okay? And for the rest of you, Five of Cups just might be a temporary disappointment and you can move on from there, okay? Anyways, have a fantastic week, Aquarius. Enjoy all the Halloween celebrations, Halloween celebrations. And even if you're not invited to any parties or anything, just get out and walk the streets and check out all the cool costumes. Don't be afraid of those clowns. They're pretty hilarious. Okay, anyways, uh, talk to you soon. Bye. Happy Halloween.